you want to go in that aspect. And um, you've definitely, looking at your journey from afar, Luke, um, you've done some amazing things and you still mm. continue to do amazing things. Where does this massive drive of yours come from? Um, early days. Uh, so when I were eight, you know, we've all got a story. We've all got um, a sob story, as I call it, stuff that drives us. Everyone listening today will have shit that they've been through. Um, my, I guess, shit started eight years old. Parents had separated, but then my mum had a car crash, which left oh. her with uh, some slight brain damage, but left her with a mental illness off the back of that called need. So non-epileptic attack disorder is quite a rare condition. It took years to get it diagnosed. Basically, I mean, she has drop attacks. Um, so I started learning about mental health way before this craze of mental health, yeah. right, before the boom of mental health. And own struggles, I were a chronic warrior. But back, you know, mm. now we call it just, uh, I would call it a born warrior. Now they just call it uh, anxiety. Yeah. Um, but that's my drive in terms of the mental health scene um, mm. of what really pushed me. So what were the real defining thing was is when I was going through all this with my mom and going to school and I were a really big kid, um, a bit of an hard time at school it, it, at certain times. And I always felt like at schools, there were always, for kids who were flipping tables and, and doing, you know, mad shit, they were, you always got an extra load of extra support. There were kids mm. like me, head down, mask on, no one knew what was going on, never really got any support. So when I started being a rugby player, I started going around and doing assemblies and started doing talks way before the boom of what people see now wow. because I always want to go back and reach back for those kids like wow. me who were in class, getting their head down. Teachers wouldn't have known because they just got on with the work and they were good kids. Uh, so go back and help kids like that. And that's where 